Hello, Paul here, and I'm excited to share with you my favorite feature in Illustrator. So much fun using Intertwine is what it's called. Probably my favorite feature. Check this out. I have this rope brush, and I'm going to draw this rope. I kind of want it to go around some of these letters, through these letters, around and down. Awesome. So I do want it to intertwine with those letters, right, and that anchor. Uh, which means typically creating like layer sandwiches and moving things or it's just a you know it's a pain trying to get that look that i'm going for for it intertwining well not anymore check this out we'll select both elements we'll go to object right down here here it is intertwine make boom and then we just go to the parts that we want to intertwine so right up here let's just go ahead and pan up right up here and we'll just circle this part hey it puts it behind and it flows through i want this to be behind hey just circle it super easy to do it puts it behind and done that can go in front maybe this can go behind this will be a bigger chunk right let's just grab all of this right i'm not even completing the circle by the way it puts it behind that'll go up even when it comes to like a, a solid shape behind it as in that o these little boxes and it just intertwines and looks gorgeous how about that look at that so much better so much better and so easy to work with awesome now you could also edit it, and, and by the way, we could take a look right off to the side. You might run into this object, but it says over here in my layers panel, intertwine. So that's kind of what's happening. But really, it's just a matter of selecting the object, going to object, down to intertwine. You can release it or edit it. In this case, we're going to edit it. So we'll jump in here. And uh, we can decide this can be maybe uh, behind. So it means drawing another box around that like that. Ready? And then it goes through and puts it behind. If I hold down the option key, it will do the opposite. It will put it in front. So you can edit this all you want, even when it comes to the path alone, right? Yeah, we can edit that path. So it's super easy to jump in there, uh, maybe remove that point, right? And uh, play, with, play with this, maybe have it curve around like this. But you get the idea. You can play with the shapes. You can play with like that intertwine-ness, do something like that sort of all you want. So uh, yeah, that is intertwine for you. Super powerful. And honestly, I just like, I can't wait to see what people create with it. It's just so fun. So create with it. Show me what you got. I'd love to see it. And uh, yeah, explore it for yourself. Thanks for watching.